So none of us can say, but obviously we strive to enter that narrow gate. Yes. We strive to do right with God. We strive to get closer to yes. God and have a relationship. Yes. And as again, we talk about the fruits of the Spirit. Yes. It takes time as a tree to you grow and cut the bit. To letting me come closer and lead a yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah, of course sure. you can, yeah. So are you, are you a Christian or a Muslim? I am Muslim. Okay. Before, I did not notice this. Uh, I will greet you with the same greetings that Jesus Christ made peace upon him. He gave to the people around him. Shlam al Shlam al Okay, but it's Shalom by basically. Uh, shalom is Hebrew. Okay. Uh, Jesus Christ maybe spoke Aramaic. Aramaic. Uh, Jesus Christ Lachon spoke is... in Aramaic, he okay, did. Yeah. Jesus Christ yeah. spoke so in Aramaic. Shalom Alachon is in Aramaic. And uh, in uh, Greek. Yeah. Jesus spoke Greek. Sorry? Jesus spoke Greek. Mm -hmm. Did Jesus yeah. speak Greek? Did he? Do you well, think? Jesus spoke Greek. Do you think no? I was Aramaic, was his Aramaic? original Jesus, language. Jesus people who what? What were they? Hmm? Jesus' people, hmm. who were they? The Jew and the Gentiles. Did the Jews? Speak Greek? Uh, did, uh, did Paul not speak Greek? Paul Say is... Paul? Uh, Paul, yeah, when, Paul when Paul, Greek, when Paul had to go to... Brother, the, he's, yes. made he's made a claim, he's made a claim. No, 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 no don't, don't interject him like that, please. Be respectful. Yeah? Actually, you know what, I retract what I said before. I hope you didn't take that as a disrespect. Thank you for putting me back in my place. Uh, I stand corrected. Uh, uh, continue what you're saying uh, before. Okay. As, as again, we're, we mean this... Uh, Francis, I've seen Francis before. Mm. You know, we have, I suppose, we're just having, I suppose, an agreement on who we pray, or direct our prayers to. Would you start. be as opposed to letting me join in the conversation as well? Well, it's a Christian, you, well, it's a Christian conversation, what would you do? Christian, Christian? Yeah. Well, I, I believe I, I, I'm, you know, born again Christian. Okay, follow Jesus Christ, follow Jesus Christ, follow Jesus Christ. No, you're not. You're not follow Jesus Christ. Christ. No, you're not. I believe you're, you. No, you do. Is he God? He's not God. Go. Then. Well. That's not the way to speak. So. No, no, but the thing is, but the thing is, because you are not follower of Jesus Christ, this is a conversation about Jesus Christ's divinity. The thing, the thing. What's your name? Well, Solomon. 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 Je yeah. As again, Jesus is was God, hundred percent God, hundred percent man. Yeah. Um, we, as if you look at the character of Christ, if you look at the things he done. Okay, then seek the truth, and the truth shall set you free. I'm yeah. here to seek the truth. You're here to Am seek. To are you looking? No, no, I can tell. I can tell by you that you are going to interject on everything. Uh, I can sense easily. I was. I'm an ex-Muslim, so which is why I left Islam because I can't. Uh, I can't resonate with someone disrespecting right, my God. Excuse me for disrespecting you. If I have, if you've taken a disrespect. If no, you, you, you listen, you're free to listen. You disrespect our no, no, God, so you I know. believe in one God to see what you believe. No, you don't believe. Well, you believe no, in Allah. You believe in how many gods? Sorry? How many gods do you believe? We, we believe in one, one God, God, three, God. three no, and one. No, of course you don't. Three and one. There is, is, it does, uh, but I don't believe in one God. Do you, can you call God the Father? Is Allah God? Sense, in what sense? Um, can you call you can Allah call, Father? You can, call God, uh, you can call Allah the Father in a certain point of view. Where? Not father as in literally he gave, he was the father of someone. No. Father as in like God he, he loved. Like he loves you like he loves a child. Oh, okay. Allah, okay. That I, do, I don't, I'm not here to mock you. What's your name? Uh, Allah, as the concept of Allah is not, is not God. You know, it's, it, there, it, there's a lot of stuff coming from Allah. And I'm not here to throw stuff at you. And I'd say, I hope you come okay. to Christ. Okay. Like, sorry, sorry. So yeah. how, do I, how, do I seek, how do I seek the truth? By engaging with Christians. Okay, why you seek the truth is see Christ. He is the how, truth. Okay, how do I seek Christ? Why can I not talk with the Christians? You can talk with the Christian, of course. Can you I should. Talk with the you should be allowed. Can I you, talk with the Christian? You, uh, you we, we, we are talking. We are conversing about what? We were conversing, but if this man, if he's willing to accept Jesus Christ as Lord and Savior, I will talk to you. Yeah. Okay. Of course. Are you so, willing okay, to accept okay, Jesus okay, Christ as Lord and Savior? I am go willing to. Okay. okay we are not going to discuss in front of a Muslim about our denominational issues because it's going to give him an ammunition. I'm not going to allow. Okay. You have to be wise. Yes. Okay. So that, you, but if you're interested in yeah, receiving no, Jesus, Lord and Savior, you, so you can accept Christianity, but I can't. Sorry. Is that, so you can accept. Christianity, no, no, no. I'm you can nominee. accept Christianity. You should I, embrace no, and hope you do. Not, okay, not, before you made a claim, no, no. Uh, I'm willing to accept Christianity if it's the truth. 
You're willing to accept Christianity if it's the truth? Okay. okay. Seek the truth and she's okay. the truth. Okay. So that, that's that's from the Bible, yes. I said to you straight away, we are talking over here about denominational things. Okay. So I we hope I didn't come out with No, no, no. But we are talking about denominational issues, which I'm not going to converse in front of a Muslim about our denominational issues, because it doesn't concern you. How do I learn? How do I learn? How do I learn about no, you don't learn. You need to learn about these. You need to learn the basics in order to come to where we well, are. The thing about learning, yeah. seek Christ, go home and pray because to because Jesus, because call upon him, repent and come put your faith and trust in him and turn for your sin. That's how you come to Christ. Basics. A torn for your sins. And so, so, so in Bible. Define basics. So, it's so a basics. Okay, so who. What, in a nutshell. Yeah, in a nutshell. What's, what's Christianity basics? From then? what I've learned. Okay. Actually, wait. Am I allowed to talk? Yeah. Yeah, yeah go for it. So, we are going to change the uh, conversation now. We are going to talk about this further later. Okay. Not okay, before, yeah? okay. okay. This is, if I came disrespectful, I will say it again and again. Because it seems, from what I can look at, it seems like you still hold that against me. And I want to say, hold excuse that, me. Well, I cannot hold, no, hold that against you. Have you excused me? Yeah, no, because I don't think. No, I can excuse you. Okay. Sorry. High five. Okay, to hold something as uh, I love Muslims. And anyone who's but we want to to get saved. If Muslims die without Christ, in your religion we're sent to hell. In you, your religion we're sent to hell because we didn't believe in Jesus Christ. Maybe one. Um, well, it's Antichrist. Islam is Antichrist. It, Islam is Christ. Antichrist. Name, Sean, Sean, I have to. I have to be truthful. If if you do not believe that Jesus Christ is the Christ, wasn't crucified on the cross, rose it? again. The Muslims don't believe that. That means it's Antichrist. Okay. That's what that, that's what it, it, it does believe that. And we, we believe that Jesus died on the cross for our sins. So if you don't agree with that, it is on Antichrist. Okay. But as I said, that's the way you're brought up. But once we're alive in Christ, you've hope. I want you to actually come here and listen. Uh, okay. The first thing I came to listen. Okay. Yeah. And if I could interject, uh, talk and interject, I would. I want okay. that permission as well. All right. So why are you Muslim? I'm Muslim. I'll actually tell you something. I'm at a stage in my life. I might have to put this somewhere down. Yeah, yeah. It has the Bible in it. I have to respect the Bible. Oh, it has a Bible in it. Yeah, exactly. Okay, I can hold it. I can hold it. Just a second. Okay, look. I'm at a stage in my life where. Let me give you an analogy. Maybe it might explain better. Imagine I'm driving a car. Yeah. And I set it off one degree wrong to the right. In the first 10 meters, it won't matter that much. But 10 miles ahead, it's going to make a huge difference. Okay. And sooner or later, there's going to be a point where I can't change back. You understand what I mean? Okay. So right now, I'm in seek the truth and truth shall set you free. Yes. I'm at that stage where I'm trying to find the truth. I want to learn more about Christianity because it has, it has given me this like... Before, I didn't know about that much about Christianity. Okay. And I was still in schools. I, how do I say this? Imagine being taught Christianity from an atheist. Can you imagine that? Um, you well, you can, th that's you basically. Can, but the guy I can it. imagine that actually, yeah. but the guy doesn't believe it, so he doesn't have the same passion, the same truth that's going to come from that. Exactly. And it's like that inside knowledge. He's only looking from the outside in, not from the inside out. He's not a Christian well, himself. He's only looking from the outside. So he, more of that would what an atheist teaching Christianity would probably put you away from Christianity, and not bring you towards Christianity. So, Someone who's in Christ will try to bring you towards Christ with the Word of God. With the Bible, and that's what true Christianity is. And there's things up here that people claim to be Christians I don't believe is true Christianity. But you are, you said you're seeking the truth. Seeking the truth. Well, so I want to learn more about Christianity, not from the Buddhists or the Muslims. Well, you, you can't learn about you can, Christianity you can, from you Buddhists. Can, you can, no, you can learn. You can maybe learn maybe a few from, bits and... Exactly. You can you learn can, something. But, but I, a Buddhist believes that Buddha is I there, learn, whatever. I he has the truth. To I can learn Christianity from a Christian, isn't it? Exactly. Two Christians are in front okay. of me. So, no. so two Christians, are, that's why I asked you. Just make me understand one thing. Why are you a Muslim? That's all I've asked. You. That's why I said uh, I'm seeking the truth. So you're I'm learning more about you're seeking the why truth. Why am I still holding to Islam? Because yes. I'm in the process of finding religion, which religion is the truth. Okay. 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 Were you born Muslim? No. I was born Muslim. Okay. And where are you from? I'm originally from Afghanistan. Oh, you're from Afghanistan? And you were born and raised in London? Yes. Neighbor, okay. A neighboring country was born in Pakistan. I came here in 2014 uh, as a Muslim and now I'm an ex-Muslim. So, uh, what was the point you wanted to tell me? About? So I, I, want to, I want to tell you about that. So Christianity, when the basics are, why do we believe Jesus is God? Okay. Yeah. That's absolute basic of the necessity of the reasonings of why I believe because he's the Alpha and the Omega. 
the first and the last. Nice. Yeah. And the one, and the one, one basic necessity. If you read the Sermon of the Mount, there's three the Beatitudes: Matthew chapter five, same Matthew chapter six, same Matthew chapter seven. Yeah. It's in your Bible. It will give you an understanding. Yeah. Of this person who came on on earth. As in the ultimate sacrifice, if you it's, understand the basis it, it, of these things, that's why you will understand why we are Christians. Chris. If we say, if supposedly, if I, if I, no disrespect, but I, as an ex-Muslim, when I read about Muhammad, and I read about the revelation that he got and how he got them. The life he lived. Sorry? Where are you reading from? No, no, I'm not reading no, where from. Where are you reading from? Sorry? About Muhammad. About about Muhammad. The Quran, no, no, isn't no, it? I, obviously. Just, just, a, just an understanding of Quran. Well, where do you read it from? Sunnah.com Do you read it from so, some guy who's walking and you hear it from him? Oh, well, the Quran. The Quran. Quran? Sunnah.com Sunnah.com Yeah, that's okay, so Hadith? Yeah, just read the Hadith. Authentic Hadith or false Hadith? No, uh, Sahih. So Sahih Hadith. Authentic Hadith okay. and Quran. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So I'm, no. I'm not going to say. Right, continue what you're saying. No, I'm not. I'm not going to say that uh, just the Quran itself, because I know Quran itself is not the ultimate authority when it comes to Islam, basically. Because the Hadiths actually are necessary in order to understand the Quran too, right? Okay. So that's well, why. That's why a lot of people say. So for me, uh, when I when I understand the Hadith, so I can say, okay, the Hadith could be wrong about the Aisha was six and then consummate the marriage at nine. That was an issue for me. I work with children. I work with people, survivors. I work with sexual. Uh, what do you call it? Uh, Are you a teacher? Sorry? Are you a teacher? Yeah. Are you a school teacher? Sorry? Are you a school teacher? I'm not going to elaborate on that. Okay. For privacy reasons. Yeah, oh, that's so, fair enough. Yeah, yeah, that's fair enough. Yeah, yeah. So, sorry? Are you allowed to disclose your name? Francis. Yeah. Your name is Francis. Yes. Uh, so. You changed your name. Sorry? Did you change your name? I'm not going to disclose that either. Oh, is, uh, this, is this one of those names where you come up and it's like not fake names? No, 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 no. It's actually my legal name now, okay. but I can't disclose my previous name. Okay. So, yeah. Francis and Sean. Sean. So when I when I read these sort of things in regards to um, when I when I when I make a comparison of the character of Muhammad and the, the, uh, character, the character of Jesus, of Jesus Christ, and, uh, that's where I came to an understanding of the sinless. Even in Islam, uh, Isa is sinless. So that's how I came to the understanding of side reading the Bible yeah. and came to came to realization that this is a man that I would follow. It's and Muhammad. I can't, I can't follow yeah. Muhammad. Muhammad, yeah. Especially of his character. Well, what character? Sorry? What character? A warmonger. So just... Uh, yeah. So like someone who just uh, wages war on other people for no... For what reason? For no reason. For no reason. Yeah, what's the point? What's the point of just starting killing other people? What's the point? It's, was he killing other people? Of course he was. Well, it, did Islam prosper under violence? Did it, uh, In a Islam, sense. Islam, comes from, uh, Islam doesn't come with a sword? No, by the sword. Okay, so are you, are you a Sufi? Uh, I'm just. I just follow the Quran. The Sunnah. No, no, no. So, but what sect are you? There's a different uh, opinion. Studies aren't there. Okay, okay. I understand what you mean. I come from the understanding that I follow the Quran and the Sunnah. Okay. Quran. I don't follow the Sunnah. Salafi. I don't follow this stuff. Okay, so you you you. you, you Quran and the Sunnah. That's Quran and the Sunnah. Authentic. Okay. So so which Sunnah would you say are the right ones? Which Sunnah do you? Sahih Bukhari. Authentic. Adik. Authentic. Uh, Sahih Muslim. Authentic. authentic yes. Uh, Tirmidhi. Authentic. Authentic. Uh, um, sorry? Umid. 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 Uzbekistan from Uzbekistan. Oh, those are Uzbekis. Those are different. Andy, uh, this is Van Sam. Uh, sorry, she was talking about something this else. This is his mother? No, no, that's not my mother. She is just an old lady who I respect when she comes to speak as well. So, this is... I admire the respect you gave me. I admire the respect you gave me. I have to give respect to everyone, but unless... The, when with that, that conversation, why I came across rude is because this was a conversation that if any Muslim would hear, would use it against us. Well, so that's why I have to protect in our behalf. As as again, Christianity, Jesus said, if someone hits you, turn the other cheek. Now in Islam, that I don't think that's the case. You know, as the, what Jesus said, if someone hits you on one one side of the cheek, turn the other. Basically, as well as said, Romans don't overcome evil with evil. Do you follow this? Do I follow this? Yeah. Well. It's the fruits of the spirit, as we were just talking about. Love, kindness, patience, if peace, I and self-control. If I slap you, you're going to turn the sheep. If you, I'll have to. I, I probably don't. Have to. Well, it's, it's good. well, it's Jesus' teachings. Now, we're going by Christ's teachings. We're not going by my actions. 
So it's Christ's teachings. I follow Jesus Christ make peace upon him. If I slap you, we'll tell that to you. I might not, I'd, I'd, I'd have no, to. No, that, that, makes, that makes you the violent one. Why, 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 if, why should if, I not? If, conditional myself? sentence, conditional sentence. If I slap him. Yeah. Well, that was the standards of Christ. That was the standards, the ethics he spoke. Yeah, I, I know, but that was the ethics he spoke. Yeah. That's what the difference he spoke and the difference of Muhammad spoke. You're yeah. saying Muhammad was a prophet from God, the final prophet, where there's no indication in the Bible of Muhammad. You know, I've even, I even met Muslims before out in Shepherd's there's Bush. There's no indication of Prophet Muhammad in the Bible. They showed me the book of John. That's not, that's not, where, is they, where is it? Where is it? They showed me the book of this, John and it no, says the world can see. Do you know, the world the, the talk about the Holy Spirit. Yeah. The world, world could see Muhammad. We obviously can't see the Holy Spirit, no, 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 you know. So I've heard Muslims even using that so there's verse. There's no mention of Muhammad in the Bible. I have never found it. I've never heard. I'd say, did you go to Deuteronomy? Do you, do, have you found one? Have you found one? One of, the, one, of the, one of the worst ways you can answer a question is by answering another question. Oh, okay. I asked you, do, do you know, I'm asking you for your knowledge. I have no knowledge no. of Muhammad in, in, in the Bible. Hmm? Do you have any knowledge of Muhammad being prophesied in the or mentioned or anything in the Bible? Nope, there is no mention of Muhammad in the Bible whatsoever. Okay, right. yeah. let's continue. Okay. Because, because the thing is, if, if Muhammad was mentioned in the Bible, uh, we were already known. But unfortunately, then the Muslims have the argument where... It's like it's covered go, up, isn't it? No, no, no. no. It, oh, Bible's, you, Bible's been corrupted. Bible's been corrupted. Corrupted, even, yeah. Even though they will just say it for the sake of it. But that doesn't yeah. make any sense to me whatsoever. Like, if it's so corrupted, then, uh, then maybe they should ask Muhammad himself, like, why they said to go back to the people of the book. Yes. Yeah. You know what okay. I mean? Do you want to advance to uh, Bible's history? Sorry? Do you the, want to advance to You want to talk about the Bible's history? Bible. Authenticity. No, 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 no. I, Do you I, want to advance to the authenticity of the Bible? He's a Unitarian. Uh, brother, that's... So... Uh, yeah. You see, look, that's... The behavior he's showing right now, I think he's mocking God or your religion. That's yeah. not the behavior that you're supposed to. Yeah, that's, but... That's one of, but but the majority of, majority of your fellow Muslims love him. Let me just explain that to which you. Which Muslims? Well. Name one. Sorry? Name one. Uh, Go ask this man. Uh, go ask this man. This one? Sorry? No, 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 not him. Go ask the other man up there. Which man? Go. Sorry? Which one? Oh, do you go Chachaji? Do you know Chacha Usman? Chachaji. Chachaji Usman? Uncle Uthman? Is he the one where he's wearing traditional Pakistani clothes or something like that? Yes, yeah, he's the one. Yeah. yeah. And, and you, you've heard him say this. Sorry? Like he loves him. Yeah, because, like, how does he not love us? Love him? Like when he said, "Oh, look, look at it. What's these Christians are doing? Like, look at it. He is a D. Have you heard this? Have you heard him say? It? Of course, I have. And I talk to him in Urdu. So if I pull him, I, I, I see him, if I pull him here, I bring him here, and I say, "Do you love this guy?" Would he say yes? Go for it. Yeah, sure. If you want to, if you're that literal, let's go for it. Mm. Yeah. And then, and then saying, but, but saying that, so okay, go for it. Yeah, good. Oh, come on, come on. All right. Continue. So, so we're talking about authenticity of the Bible. How do you know it's not being corrupted? Sorry? Well, how do you know it's not being corrupted? Well, do we not have the... the for the for the centuries throughout, we have biblical... Uh, and prophets and archaeologists have searched the Bible like a treasure map. And as well, the predictions that the Bible has said over nearly two, nearly 2,000, all prophecies has never been discredited. Now, if the it's Bible... never been discredited. All the prophecies the Bible has made. The Bible has made so many prophecies of things that's going to happen and in the future. And it's never, ever been. Well, there's the, every prophecy the Bible has said has happened. Show me one, one, one prophecy the Bible hasn't made. That has, I'll go into a few. Talks about... The Israel nation coming back. It came back in 14th of came back in May 1948. The 14th of May 1948. Israel got the sovereignty back. Talks about the coming of Christ. I mean, 1400 years. Okay, the Bible. Oh no, was taken to rest. Now all the prophets and all that spoke of the coming of Christ, didn't they? Spoke of Jesus the coming. Yeah, the prophet. All that of Christ. I mean, Jesus coming was spoken by Isaiah. It was John spoken. The well, he said, he, John the Baptist said, Behold, here comes the Lamb of God who takes away the sin of the world. Um, so, if that, the Bible, wasn't true, as again, it's the best sold book of all time. In history, the Bible is the best sold book in history. I don't know what this man agree with me here beside me. It is in history. Now, if the Bible was discredited for the prophecies that it made and predictions, it would be useless. But it hasn't been disproven yet. So are you saying if someone shows you a... You want prophecy or contradiction? Prophecies? A, a prophecy. Okay, a prophecy that's been proven wrong. What's going to happen? 
turn the Bible then is... throw out the Bible like you just said a few moments ago? Well, then it's not the infallible word of God, because God is, we believe God is divine, holy, can see, omnipresent, omniscient. So if the, it makes a mistake, God doesn't make mistakes. So if there's a mistake, we think go for the God word of God. If there's mistakes in the Bible of prophecies that things are have to happen, hasn't happened, and yeah. So if one prophecy is thrown, uh, proven wrong, we're going to chuck the Bible out? If one prophecy, well, I, it's... I mean chuck the Bible out metaphorically, yeah? Don't literally start well, disrespecting Well, the thing is, okay, as, is, as again I said, if there prophecies was disproven that was in the Bible that every prophecy the Bible has said has happened. We know the coming of Rome, Greece, we know the Israel getting a salmon tree, we know the coming of all Christ, right, right, drying up the Euphrates you River. You're, 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 no, 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 you're claiming a lot, brother. I As you get, no, I'm just giving, I'm just giving. If, if has been what has been disappeared that you're trying to uh, uh, affirm to? I haven't claimed anything. Okay, so, okay. so, you are, so you're just asking if it's Actually, true. no, I retract what I said. Maybe I've claimed a few How things. Okay. But these claims about what? Uh, about yeah, that's what I'm saying. So do you what have, have what issue do you have with the Bible? Yeah. Could I ask you that? Yeah, you were saying about, the, you about, about a catch. No, no, no. Like, brother, you're acting a bit too sus for me, right? No, no, no. No, no, no. no, no you, act, you are acting too sus. No, no, no. Like, I, in all honesty. What do you mean suspicious? No, you're acting suspicious because in regards to like stupid it's questions you're asking and your expressions okay, that's just are a bit too, are a bit too excessive. I'm not accustomed to being spoken like that. No, sorry? I'm not accustomed to being spoken like that. You were very kind before. You treat me the same no, way. No, but. No, no. Because guys. the thing is, because the thing is, your attitude and your and your uh, and your actions are a bit a bit too suspicious. Because the way you're conversing about things, like what sort of things have you got, and what sort of uh, understanding there is, or why there's an issue, you really chuck the Bible away and stuff like that. I'm sorry to say, let me just tell you, explain to you one thing quite clearly here. Muhammad was a fucking pedophile, right? Okay. Good, who? Please. No, no, no. Just a sec. Muhammad was a pedophile who fucked a nine-year-old. And that's why I left Islam, because I can't believe in a man that you're in a religion with a pedophile as a prophet and you claim him to be a man of God. Are you serious? Like, are you joking? Is that, and you say that you're a Muslim? Like, I'm sorry to say, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be very honest with you. I can't actually respect someone who had that issue. No, I'm talking about Yeah, I had it, I had it. He's representing the Christians, let him represent the Christians. Sean, should have, Sean as his brother, should have stopped the Christians don't him. follow Isa hey, hey, al-Islam. I'm telling you. Sean as his Christian brother, he Isa al-Islam never preached him Christianity. Him. He didn't stop him, didn't stop him. Yeah. but I'm going to stop you. Isa al-Islam, peace, peace be upon him, never preached Christianity. No, stop because Do you I'm disagree with me? Because I need to explain it to you. Where did you go? Nah, he never taught Christianity. Worship Allah. Where did you go? He ran off that way. Who? I don't care, man. No, okay. Do you get it? Do you get it? Well, it's lads. No, but do you get it? Brother, look. No, all prophets don't worship Allah. Well, oh, no, yeah. Jesus was where God. Did, did no, that's, that's, that's your own God. idea. Jesus Christ is but God. Guys. There's no, no right. need so, for anger, so but we just... So this is the thing. No one's angry here. No, no, but the thing is... The people that are inciting violence like no, 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 that no, no, woman, no, no. she's making Francis, people angry no, no. by saying... You need to walk away. What did go she away. Say that, what did she say that was Go bad? away. I'm going to ask you to go away after not being struck. Do you want him in the conversation? Yes or no? No, no. What is she doing? What is she doing? What? This is how it ends, you know. Well, Just it's arguments, stupid arguments, and then. Well, the thing is, things were said there that we have to understand that uh, not the way the language that God uses. No, now he's but, gone right? out of the plane. So let me explain to you one thing. Guys, come here. Literally, I'm gonna ask you: Was Muhammad a pedophile? Yes. Was Muhammad a pedophile? Was Muhammad a pedophile? Was Muhammad a pedophile? Was Muhammad a pedophile? No. Muhammad was yes. What do you mean he not? He was, yes. Was he a pedophile? So, yes. so you tell me. Did you say he was a No, Christian. Jesus calls Jesus. Muhammad did that. Muhammad did that. It's better for, for him to be. Well, I have a millstone around his head. It's better to be five plus four. No, no. It's better for that person. Why is it no? Why is it no? I am telling him to leave Islam because of because of his pedophile religion. A pedophile boy. He is doing the right thing. No, he wants to have a conversation. He is suspicious. That's why I'm telling him on the stage. 
That's why I force these bumps. That's what I do. Bro, you, you don't have to. If, it, if, it, if you're a body, Obviously. you and pedophilia is right, you don't have to fight for it. Exactly. Just say it. Is Muhammad a pedophile? No. Yes, he is. He's why, would he marry, why would he marry a six-year-old? What age did, did Allah say he should sleep with her? Okay, what age did Allah say he should, he should marry her? Why, Allah didn't give an age. Why, in all honesty, 18 in the time wasn't quite there. Do you want me to come back into this conversation? Okay. I mean, I'm sure maybe some people know me for my respect for other people. Okay. I don't disrespect. I'm sorry, you, 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 yeah, you, you don't look respectful. Oh, yes, brother. Say, no, it's was I disrespecting you? No, you wasn't. God Thank bless you. you. No, but. Right. To, 100%. But to say, Allah can point to you, Allah can point to you, call to Jesus, call to Christ, go to Jesus. But to say, listen, bro, to say Muhammad is a pedophile, it's not disrespectful. It's just naming the fact. It's naming the fact. Does he disrespect Jesus? Does he disrespect Jesus? Answer me yes or no. If, okay. No, 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 no. I'm not going to answer. I've only spoken to him first. No, 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 we need to talk. The way, okay, the way he was coming across, I have to say, there's a way you're talking about the Bible, there was things that you were kind of we, uh, ridiculed you're in a sense. No, 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 no. You, you were but antagonizing, aren't you? It was, just, uh, was just being... With your questions, you it wasn't direct. Direct. Yeah. Yes. You a Muslim disrespect Jesus. Yes. You are disrespecting You say Jesus God. is a Muslim. You came in the conversation, you said peace What's be upon him. By saying Jesus is a Muslim, that's disrespectful. That's blasphemy. Jesus is a prophet? Oh, well, that's blasphemy. Jesus was not a Muslim. Jesus, Jesus was a Christian. Now, do you believe blasphemy. Jesus was a Muslim? Jesus is Jesus not. He's not. He's not. Jesus is God. He's not a Muslim. You, you prove he's it. Not a Muslim. How, how is, yeah. What is, okay. Let's go, go step, step, let's go step by step. Let's go step by step. What is a Muslim? From what I've learned, of course, my knowledge is not perfect like God. No, me too. Learned, me too. Muslim is someone who submits his will to okay. God. Okay. So no, 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 no. Muslim. Muslim is someone who submits. Muslim. Someone who is, is submits someone, okay. to the teachings of Muhammad. I'll even hold on to your, um, your idea. If I have a rock and I say this is my one true God, a rock that I've built myself. Yeah, no, 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 that's a Muslim. No, 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 no. I submit to that's my God. That's my that's my God. That's the definition of a Muslim. Someone a rock? Yes, yeah, that's God. 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 Yes. Whoever is God of it's a rock. What is a rock? What do you mean by God? What do you mean that's, by God? That's, then? That's, yeah. Jesus is God. God. No, a Muslim is not someone who submits their will to God anymore. So it has to be a particular type of God. What is a God? What is I don't have three faces, I can't talk like that one time. Okay, I won't talk like this though. Yeah, I'm listening. What was your question? What is the definition of a Muslim? Okay, I think I already answered that question. Which someone who please? Okay. So okay, the, 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 the will to God. God. What if I don't have the same? Listen, listen. Ask okay, him. Let's go one by one. I, I, ask him. We don't have the same Muslim. idea of God. I know. We don't have the same idea. Let me speak for you. Okay. You start to entertain the fact that we worship a rock. No, that's not what I said. I didn't say you worship. No, 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 no. I said if I do it. If something, excuse me, I stand corrected. When you start saying something like, oh, if I worship the God and I submit my will to the God. Yeah, that is a rock. Excuse yeah, me. That's, yeah, that's, that's my God. Of course, what, what if that's my God? Of course, I'm a Muslim worshiping by that definition. Worshiping rocks is idolatry. Well, oh, that's, that's your belief. That's your belief. You. But the I definition you gave about uh, well, Muslim if, if I, if I, fits if I, in his. If I built a rock, analogy here. If I built a rock and I said, that's my God. And, my, and I submit my will to that, to that rock. That's the definition you've given. That's the definition that you've given as a Muslim. That's my God. So I'm a Muslim. You can say that uh, 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 a follower of Islam is who follows the uh, Quran. Oh, yes. okay. So, so no, Muslim, what, what, by definition, change your, is, change your definition. Yeah. What, what, it's like anyone who submits to God. Right. Which what is God? Some, what is we don't Muslim? know. Oh, you, need, you need to look up, but you need to answer. Why are you a Muslim? I don't need to. I can. Okay. Okay. Fair enough. So, why are you a Muslim? After knowing he's a pedophile. Are you still okay with that? Okay. Are you are you okay God with Surah, God, five, no, no. Surah 65 verse no, no, no. four? No, you okay? No, okay. Just a sec, brother. Why are you okay with pedophilia? Did I say I was okay with pedophilia? Why you're still a Muslim? You are okay with it. You are actually giving into a prophet. Did I, did I make a claim that I approve uh, pedophilia? No, but you are you are a Muslim. Yeah, I'm a Muslim. You are a Muslim. You're following a prophet. Your prophet Muhammad was a pedophile. So, uh, as a 54 year old man having sex with a nine year old, is that is a pedophilia. So you're okay with pedophilia. So, so you're being a Muslim, God, so you're a Muslim a, a who is a pedophilia. In your looks that oh, okay. you're giving me, I, I can suss no, no, you out. These, these are not disrespectful looks. No, 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 I can understand. Maybe maybe, maybe you want to kill me or something. You never know with the people uh, anyway. Let's, let's not oh, make, you never I, know with people, people, but I want to tell you. I don't that's not attack personality. Well, well, you never know. She was playing with dolls to signify why she was still a child, not had a period. Because only women, um, adults don't play, 
with, with, with dolls. If she, if she was a yeah, woman, she man. wouldn't play with dolls. Aisha was playing with dolls, so she was still a child at the age of nine, mm -hmm. and the Prophet slept with her. That's pedophilia. Yeah. What, okay. what, what, My why? Islamic perspective as well. So yes, you're a Muslim who's following Muhammad. Muhammad is a pedophile. Okay, okay. What you're okay with that. You, okay. you said you were ex-Muslim. Yes. What caused you to go from ex-Muslim? Stop jumping questions. Mm. No, it's no, all right, right. It's all right. No, I think. I think one of his main reasons that he left. Uh, no, yeah, one, main reason, one main reason. One main reason is no, pedophilia. Focus on one question. Oh, yeah, right? Exactly. That's how he links. Yeah. Okay. One main reason is pedophilia. I can't resonate or reason with anyone about pedophilia. I work with children, I work with survivors yeah, who have been sexually abused, right? I know the mental health and ramifications of it physically, mentally and emotionally, or what happens to the child. Mm. So uh, if in that time, even though it might be okay, they, are, they might be psychologically different, there might be anything, but to me, even though at that time or this time, doesn't matter, he is the best example of all mankind. For yeah. me, it is an issue. Okay. So you follow, follow you, you are still a Muslim. That's my issue. Okay. You're still a Muslim. You follow a pedophile. How Why? is that okay? Okay. There's many claims to what you're saying. No, 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 there's not many claims. I, I'm, I'm more elaborative on the pedophilia okay. part, so yeah. Okay, okay. What's your definition of uh, pedophilia, Francis? A child who fucks a child, a man uh, who fucks a child is a pedophile. That's, okay. That's and who not, is Muhammad? If I pull out Google, that's going to be the definition. Are you serious? Are you, are you going to go with that place? Please, me? Do not, do not even go on the you know, education the linguistics you know. on me. Because your education linguistics okay, are not going to resonate with me whatsoever. In, even with whatever in regards you say, oh, pedophilia, what's your definition of pedophilia? Okay, so 54 year old man is having sex with a nine year old. Nine it's not a pedophilia, right? And you think God will do that? That, 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 one thing that makes sense with you? What's your definition of pedophilia? Sleeping with a child. Is under 18? No. Sleeping with a child. What's the child? What's the, what's the definition no, of child? No, no, no. Age? You are you okay know, with it. You're, try, you're trying to justify it. Why are you trying to justify no, no, no. it? It's a nine-year-old. I'm trying to work out the definition. She didn't have no, a no. I don't need to give you a definition. She was playing with dolls. I don't need to give she you a definition. She wasn't a woman. You're right, you're right. You don't need to give it to me. And I, but for the people who are across for the people, to justify I, I think any, anyone who knows who are pedophiles, the definitions. Do you, if, I, if I ask you what's a pedophile, do you do I need to reason with you or what's pedophilia? No, no, no. Yeah, do I need yeah. to reason with you? You're trying to justify. Like, are you serious? Okay. Anyone okay. can anyone around can, me. Same thing I can flip over and put Go for on. it. Yeah. In approximately 1970, yeah. you can marry a 14-year-old child. Did okay. I care? Does that make any okay? Oh, no, so, 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 so Muhammad, so someone, no, 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 Muhammad being the best example. Don't no, 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 what you, what so you're doing is, no, of course not. You, because, because, because you're allowing because pedophilia, no, 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 you're on the camera. So you don't want to let me speak. No, 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 no. the reason why, the, no, the, the reason why, because Muhammad, Muhammad, Muhammad himself was the best example of all mankind. He's a prophet of God, of Allah, basically, who came to us is a pedophile. I care about that because he has a of morality. Whatever happened in 1940s, 50s, 60s, he 70s, 80s, 90s, I don't care. care. We don't care so because don't care. I would, I would, I would, I would call He's them a pedophile man. and I would tell them to yeah, hell with them. Yes, to hell with them. Okay, so okay. that's Let what I'm going to do. Discussion with you, Yvonne. What's your definition of pedophilia? Someone who sleeps with a child. What's your definition of a child? Because child could be uh, someone. I could uh, be a child. No, no, you're not a child. You're not a child. Are you a child? No, you're not a child. A child is someone within 18. If you want to put an age to, age to it, yes. Under 18. Um, puberty, um, past the age of puberty. Past the age of puberty. Past. Plus, plus not, plus not starting. Plus not starting. Past. Well. What do you mean past the age of puberty? So As in puberty. finish puberty. So when do you finish puberty? So your definition of when a boy turns into a man is when they finish puberty? Yeah. So if I haven't finished puberty, does that mean I'm still a boy? Yes. So I could, so excuse me if I'm a bit crude, so me, you know, puberty is a is a is a okay, biological okay. process. So biologically, right? I can go. Excuse me for my. It's gonna get. Crude. Just let's just go. Why are you trying language? to justify pedophilia? No, no, no. no, 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 no I'm letting you finish. All of this. Good, for, good. We like we like it. I don't excuse mind. Excuse me for being crude. No. Imagine if I go and impregnate nine women, and I haven't finished my puberty. Does that make me? You shouldn't have sex. You can stop with your sperm. Huh? Say it again. Does that make me a beautiful? Say it again. Say it. Okay, look. Me, if I haven't finished puberty. Uh, I want age. I want age. Let's entertain it. I want age. Let's say you. You're going people. out of the point. No, 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 no. Very close to the point. point. It's, no, it's it no, is no, going no. out of the point. No, sister, it's sister. No, no. You're justifying no, no. I'm not your sister. I'm a 72 year old woman. Not my child, okay. he's my child, okay. he's my child. Yeah. Okay. So my don't tell me about children. Please don't tell me that. Okay, auntie. Are you Pakistani, by the way? Whatever I am. It doesn't matter. Okay, it doesn't matter. Auntie. This is very close to the topic he's talking about because you're saying I'm out talking out of context. I'm talking about people age, puberty, 
pedophilia, which is what they're talking about, roughly. Now look, if I haven't finished puberty, and I... At what age? Let's say I finish around 17. Yeah. Okay. Okay, and I go sleep with a 16-year-old. With a 16-year-old? Yes. Yeah. A girl, by the way. Yeah. Okay. Does that make me a beautiful? That's age relative. People, people can marry um, 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 a 16 year old can marry a 16 year old. Well, okay, look, look. Wait, wait, wait. You're, so you're playing, you're playing, we're playing a case. false equivocation because we're talking about a 50 year old man that slept with a 9 year old. No, we're talking you're about a 17 year old and a 16 year old. We are, to, we are the ones who came with the example. Coach, you're trying to justify pedophilia. Oh, no. That is disgusting. Do you know what Jesus Christ said about that? Jesus said, if you pose any of these. Wait, wait, wait. Let me just explain. I'm using theology as well. We don't know what you're talking about because you haven't even given us a full definition of what pedophile is. You're just trying to ask questions to jump away from what we're talking no, about. No, 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 jump away. No, you are, you are jumping away. You're jumping away. You're jumping away. Yeah. How am I jumping away? What is a 50 no, year old man? You're, 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 jump, you're jumping away over. because you're not okay. able to answer yeah. that you yeah, as a, your prophet are pedophile, question, but you're okay with it. I've got a question as of today, yeah? yeah, yeah I'm already a, handling a few questions here. If you had a little girl, would you let her marry marry someone at six years old? Okay, hold on. Yes or no, straight. Look, what's your definition of pedophilia and what's your Let definition of a child? We, we already gave our definition. What's your yeah. definition of a pedophile and what's the definition of a child? We already we said a uh, grown man uh, sleeping with a child. That's our definition, point blank. What's okay, your okay, definition okay. now? So let me give you a disclaimer. Let's say I'm um, 17, 18 and I sleep with a 16 year old. Does that make me a pedophile? Oh pedophil? my gosh, what's your definition? I don't want to question. What is your, your definition, definition of, of a pedophile? Of a pedophile? Because, um, what, definition what's your of definition pedophil? of a child? Yeah. Okay, excuse me if I get this wrong from the English dictionary. Pedophile is someone, from what I've learned, who sleeps, you know what I mean by sleeps, yeah? Who sleeps with a child. Yeah. Okay. What does child mean? Someone okay. who's playing with dolls. Does that say in the dictionary? Yeah, I, no, no, Aisha was playing with dolls. So if I play with dolls right now, does that make me a child? No, no, no. In the, in, in no, according exactly. to Islam, in, no, no, it doesn't. I didn't say no to what you're saying. What's the definition of a child? In, the, in according the to Islam, okay. Aisha was still a child because she, she was playing with dolls. What's a child? That's, That's my question. So it's a, it's a someone who's playing with dolls. Another a child answer. is someone who's. No, no, no. I want to use Islamic theology because it, it seems like he wants to run away to any other thing but Islam. Okay, so what's the definition of a child? Another question. 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 Why do, you, why do you throw your Islam and Muhammad under the bus when it comes to logic and reason? Someone who plays with, with dolls is a child. Someone who plays with dolls is a child. Is Aisha, was Aisha okay, playing so with if, dolls? So if I play with dolls, does that, make me, does that make me a child? According to Islam, yes. Which proof, which uh, hadith or which proof can show me that in Islam? Don't don't put your. Hold on, hold on. Do you, you know it's going to be Anyone who plays right? with a doll. Yeah, I'll bring it up to you. I'll bring it up to you. I'll bring it so up to you. So if I play with a doll, does that make it's, me a child? In Islam, you can't play with doll because it's prohibited. You can't play with a doll because it's it's not allowed. It's not permissible unless if you're a child. Aisha was okay. a, was a child at the age of nine because she was playing with so dolls with play, her okay. friends. So what's the definition? And Muhammad of climbed on her okay. and slept with her. That's okay. disgusting. Okay. Death sentence. What's the definition of a child? That's my question. Someone who's playing with dolls. I'll use the Islamic definition. That's what I want to use. Use me your definition. Nope. I want to use the Islamic definition. Someone who's playing with dolls. Because your definition. I want to use the Islamic. That's my definition. Someone who's playing with, with a child. One's man with dolls. Look, one's man's terrorist is another man's freedom. I don't fighter. care. I want to use your, your definition I, I, of a child. I don't care. Maybe my definition is, from my definition of a child. My definition of a child is someone who's playing with, do with dolls. That's my definition. Okay, so if I play with dolls, technically I'm a child to you. Te Islam, te technically yeah. you're an apostate. You, you shouldn't be playing with dolls because it's images. No, according to your definition, if I play with dolls, that makes me a child. Yeah. If you want to throw, if you want to throw that, then you are an apostate. You don't believe in okay, Allah. What's your definition of a child then? Someone who's playing with dolls. If I play with a doll, does that make me a child? Yeah, according to Islam, you're an apostate. You're not Muslim anymore. Does that make me a child? Yes or no? I take on to the Islamic perspective. Someone who's playing with, with okay. dolls. Okay. What does a child mean? Someone who's playing with dolls. If Stop. I play with dolls, does that make me a child? Yes or no? Yeah. Question. You're no, asking no, no, the wait, same wait, thing again. Wait, wait, wait. No. Do not do that. I see. You see how we stop. Stop acting like Muhammad Hijab. You're not Muhammad Hijab. Stop asking questions. Right, he can bark all the way down, but you can't do that. What's the definition of a child? What's your definition of a child? From what I learned. Yeah. Excuse me if I'm wrong. Excuse me if I'm wrong. Yeah. My definition of a child is, for example, for a girl, mm -hmm. you know, the first time she bleeds. That's not a child. I mean, that, I mean, are I mean, you asking for my definition? Are you going to accept it? I'm listening. I'm listening. Okay. From what I, from my perspective, someone who passes, you know, the first signs of puberty. That's when you become a from transition from so boy old to enough man to or girl to bleed old enough to breed. That's disgusting. Okay, that is okay. disgusting. Look, look, if you can't give me the definition of child and you're saying you gave me your definition, no, 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 no. And I disagree no, no. with it. Okay, we, what's your we can we can we can we can define actual it. definition my, my, uh, of a child of a child, of yes. a child. from the age of um yes yes one yes one to the age of 
12 after then you're a teenager why 12 after because you're a teenager you're a grown adult you're 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 um, um you're, you're you're a mature young man so can a 12 year old boy uh, impregnate a 12 year old girl yes they're they they're, they're within the same age so would that make we're talking about a 50 year old man would they make him a nine year old is, it doesn't make, make him a pedophile they're the same okay, age okay so What's, it's Stands how, how, does that, so, so, how does that? So, 54 year old man is okay with the pedophile. So is that 50, is, is no, 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 no. He's right. What, 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 what I'm trying to say is, what, no, no, no. What I'm trying to say is that what you're trying to play over here is What's actually legalize. To, 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 are you trying to legalize pedophilia? Yeah, I mean, is that what you're no, no, reasoning? Around, around. Are you a pedophile? What do you mean, am I? Are you a pedophile? No, 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 no. I don't need to look. Answer me, yes or no. Are you a pedophile? I don't need to answer you. You're telling me I don't need to look. Okay, okay. I can say the same thing to you. Okay. But I don't treat you with that type of disrespect no because no because, you, because no, no i would treat you with disrespect because you tr you actually accept a muhammad who is a pedophile you are a muslim who accepts What's your a definition of no no i don't need to define you anything i don't need to define you anything you are following a pedophile no. that makes you a pedophile apologist that's okay what you can do is say uh, you can die with uh, uh, apologizing for pedophilia you can try legalizing pedophilia i will say to you to hell with you to hell with your entire existence and go and get lost is this your Christian behavior? This Absolutely. is not Christian like. Get, this is not Christian like. Yourself, get out. Hush. Out. I'll say Allah is a get, pedophile. Get lost. Well. I'll say, I will ask you, get lost. God, we don't we need people God like God you following a pedophile. Okay, your okay, God is a pedophile. No, 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 get out. Okay, okay. No, 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 I don't need to then talk to you. God no, 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 we don't need to listen to this man. Why is your God he, a pedophile? He's a, he's a pedophile apologist. He thinks Muhammad the Jab and people are, that are okay with pedophilia. He can come in and say pedophilia is okay. okay. We're not okay with pedophilia. Are you okay with pedophilia? Why are you okay with pedophilia? No, no, no. We don't need to. We don't need to. We don't need to go anywhere. Get lost. This is the vile, vile human beings that we have come across in our lives who will accept pedophilia, who will talk about pedophilia. Like with the with the issues are that people don't even realize that what's the age, what's a child, what's this? They would not think within a second of what they're talking about. They will say, what's a child? Or what's a pedophile? What's your definition of something? How can that be okay? As a Muslim, think about this. You have a child of your own. Your six-year-old child will come to you and say that dad or mom, I don't want to be married off to this 51-year-old man, would as a father or a, or a mother, would you not have an issue with someone asking for your daughter to be married off like this? Of course you would have an issue. So with these people, they are asking for a definition of pedophilia, they're asking the definition of a child. Is that what we have come to? In this country, I can understand in Afghanistan, they could fuck children, they could do whatever the fuck they want to, but these people in Afghanistan do bachabazi, all that filth and dirt, get the fuck away from my face. And I said to you right now, you gotta, uh, let's, 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 let's get me, away me. from me right now. You gotta okay. leave it now. Get, get me, lost. You're a Bachabazi. These are funny and these Pakistani people. I'm from Pakistan, but Bachabazi in Pakistan with the pedophilia in their religion. Get lost. Don't, 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 okay, get, get away. Get him away from me. Get him away. No, get the fuck away. No, uh, we're not gonna listen to this a pedophile. We don't need to listen to a pedophile apologist. We don't need to listen. No, no, no. Shut up. Shut up. Go away. Go away. Hush. Go fuck your pedophile prophet. Go fuck with everything else. Go fuck your Allah. Fuck Allah. Go fuck your Muhammad. Piss. Piss off. Piss off. Fuck all your pedophile apologists. Pedophile apologists. This is what they ask you about pedophilia. They ask you. What is okay and what's yeah, not okay? What's the definition of child? What's the definition of pedophile? Try to justify it. Come here. You tell me, if I say a pedophile, do you think it's all right for me to say, what do you mean by pedophile? What do you mean by a child? Can we yeah. as a human being not understand what the fuck is a pedophile? Guys, I understand the guy, he, he did come out of Islam. He, he, he did come out of Islam, so he knows the... the, the wait, wait, wait. Revelation 22, 13. 
Revelations 22:13. Yes, where YouTube Jesus confesses he, God, he is God. No, no, Go and worship that God. YouTube channel. That's the YouTube channel we're going for. Revelations 22:13. 13, you see it on YouTube. Just type in speaker's corner, you find it. The brother did come out of Islam, so he knows in, in, uh, inherently what Islam brings. He is from Pakistan, he knows what these people do. You can go to Peshawar. You can go to Peshawar right now. In Peshawar, Bachabazi. In Peshawar, they will dress, men will dress young boys in girlish clothes. They put the makeup on them, they put a wig on them, they make them dance, they make them twirl around themselves, and they make them twerk, and then what happens? And after that, the best of the money giver gets to lay with the boy. I am this is what happens in Peshawar. This is what happens in Afghanistan. I am also from Nigeria and it's also a similar case where even recently <laughs> 200 girls were taken by the by the Awusa Fulani Muslims that are in, um, um, integrating into, um, into Christian Nigeria and taking away all of our girls and, and um, gender mutilation. All of this is disgusting. And they are justified by saying it under Allah. They do all of these acts and say, Allah, who Akbar. I have to be against that. That's disgusting. Jesus Christ gave a death sentence on anyone that, is, that comes any harm to children. He said Amen. it is better for Amen. you to have a millstone tied around the head, be thrown into the sea. I, 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 the brother is passionate, you know, and I understand where he's coming from, but this is disgusting behavior. Come out of this cult and come to the one true God, Jesus Christ. Amen. Anyone, I would say to anyone watching this, you can meet any Pakistani man who has a child, ask them. Ask them one thing. Are you okay with your daughter or your, or, or your, what do you call, son? being asked by a 51-year-old, would you be okay with that? If you're okay with it, you have got serious issues. I work with children. I know sexual survivors. For heaven's sake, emotionally, physically, mentally, those people are damaged. And you guys think that it's not damaging for them. And people like Muhammad Ajab and people like that pedophile apologist, all these, all these Pislamians, they, this is okay. With these Islam, they say, oh, free Palestine, free Palestine, free Palestine. But when it comes to the children, when are you gonna free them from this cult? When is when are you gonna free from the pedophilia? Free, free from pedophilia. That's what I say first. You have got no humanity on anything. Free Palestine. Yes, the children of Palestine are as much as victims of everyone. Like these people, like Aisha was a victim of Muhammad. That's all I'm gonna say. Screw them. Let them come to their senses. Let them come to a realization. Muhammad is not a moral man to follow. All you need to follow is you need to look within yourself. What would you look uh, if a pedophile is doing something in front of you? Uh, if looking upon something, looking upon someone, a child with dirty looks, what would you as a human being do? You would you do? You'd screw them. <laughs> humiliate them, Dis you will disgust it. That's all I'm gonna say. God bless guys, nice to meet you all. Thank you very much. That's my message. Stay away from Islam and literally, like the way they say, Hakallah, I would say, fuck Allah. <laughs>